I consider myself a fairly meme guy. Like I'm fairly internet-y. I'm not very plugged into pop culture, but yeah. internet-y. I, I have a large collection of memes. Yeah. Okay? And one of my producers, I will not say which one to embarrass <laughs> this producer, said, are you aware of this meme of Joshua? And I yeah. said, I'm not. And he said, it's, it's this funny meme. It's from a porn scene. Yeah. It's, it became, it took on a life of its own. Yeah. So and it's you, it's you in a bathtub yeah. and someone comes in and says, hey, you're at the beach and you need a lifeguard or something. You say, I'm not at a beach, I'm in a bathroom or something. Yeah, like yeah. So, um, to, so there, there was this meme and it's been shared probably, I think it's been shared over 100 million times. It became really popular on me, uh, on Vine. Okay. And then it became really popular on TikTok. But there's this scene where, uh, this goes to the, the ridiculous of the writing. It yeah. happens in, in yeah. pornography. But um, I'm in a bathtub, and then a lifeguard runs in. Yeah. And she's like, get out. There's a shark in the water. <laughs> and I was like, what are you talking about, lady? Like, this is a beach. It's not a, you know, this is, a, this is not a beach. I'm this in a is bathroom. a bathtub. Yeah. yeah that's, so that's what I say. I say, this is not a beach. It's a bathtub. And, but with a, with like, s like straight face, you know? It, you know, it's funny. It is, is it? it a, it's a very funny bit in that it's, uh, maybe, maybe a lot of porn is like this, but it, that strikes me as it's so self-aware about what it is. There's oh. no, there's no real pretense. It's just like, ha ha, we're here. And, right. Or, yeah. You know I mean, like she, like, she ran in with like the little like lifeguard <laughs> thing and she's wearing like, she's dressed in like, like Baywatch, you know, she's got the yeah. red bathing suit on. <laughs> You know, and she comes in. I'm just sitting in the bathtub, and and that's and that's the meme. It's like this isn't a beach; it's a bathtub. Like, is the meme? So, if this went viral during the years of Vine, were you out of the industry at this point, or were you still in it? Vine was like 2012 ish. Yeah, so I got out at in 2012. So this so, is right around the time. Yeah, so it went it went viral then, and then it went then then people started like remaking it on YouTube, and then it got yeah. popular on TikTok as well, um, and then. I found out about TikTok and I was like, and I, well, so through finding out like how like popular TikTok was being, I take, I took a peek at TikTok and I'm like, oh, this is not for me. You know, this, yeah. is, this is bad. This is bad <laughs> yeah. news. Yeah. It's like, you think uh, regular social media is bad? Yeah. TikTok is just crack because there's no home screen. Right. So you're just always in some video yeah. with music. And, and then, and, but then I, then I talked with someone and it was like, well, there's, um, there's your, your for you page. And then there's a, a page where just the people you follow. Yeah, I was like, anyway, and they're like, well, you know, they're showing me data. It's like, how many, you know, this is the most downloaded app, you know, in this age yeah. demographic and so on. And I started thinking like, well, okay, you know, my objective is to reach people with the gospel. So how, how could, how could I leverage this for that? I'm like, let's, uh, let's, let's think about this. And then I, I start doing some research and then someone sent me like, hey, have, have you seen this meme? Or like something about the meme, and I was like, I have no idea, you know, because it became popular like after I was out of the industry, so I have no idea about it. And I I did some research on it. I was like, man, like hundred million views, like a hundred million times this thing's been shared. And it's like as far as like popularity of memes, it was like top twenty of like, you know, it was when one at one point it was like one of the most popular memes that existed. <laughs> and um, I was like, this is this is ridiculous. And then I made a TikTok around it. And it was like, but it was like uh, who I who I used to be, and who I am today. And it was, and it was just and it was just like a back and forth of like it was that picture, and then like me getting baptized, and then like that a, a picture of me in the industry, and mm. then me getting married, and a, and a picture of me in the industry, um, and then you know me like. The, you know, it, nice or, family. Yeah. Or, yeah. I, and then, you know, it, it reached, you know, so, so I, I've been sharing, like, not just with the meme, but just like sharing my testimony. And uh, so just, I, I shared something along that lines uh, on Instagram uh, about a month ago, and it reached 7 million people. But the organization that we put together, so it's one thing to reach a lot of people. So we, we've got an ecosystem where, there's, you know, using AI, yeah. uh, there, there's, there's keywords that if you type, you'll get a message and that message routes you to an opportunity to, you know, like mm -hmm. biblical literacy or like talk to a person or if you're struggling with pornography, there's, there's a, a website that we've created that there's a 10 steps of how to be free from it. And so it took that, it's great to reach millions of people, 
but we took that and, and, and created a systemized way of connecting peop all those people to the next step, whether it be like freedom from pornography or hearing the gospel or being connected to a church or, or whatever.